So guys, smoked salmon, scrambled egg. So it's basically like cooking a scrambled egg. That's what we're doing, is cooking a scrambled egg and we're adding smoked salmon to it. Smoked salmon's diced fine. So as a garnish, what we're gonna do is some cherry tomatoes, cut in half and they're seasoned with salt and pepper. So into our frying pan, we put a tiny bit of Donegal rapeseed oil. That's the oil we use in the hotel. So we're gonna let our pan heat up a bit before we add. And into the scrambled egg pan, the first thing we're gonna add is our cream. So it's again, double cream. And we're gonna add a tiny knob of butter. We're gonna add our pepper. So it's again our ground black pepper, but you can use white pepper as well. Just not too much. You bring that to the boil. And we turn it down again, just a very like the chowder, we turn it down to number six. And let it reduce kind of slowly. Again, that's not to split. That's not to split the cream. So now we're gonna add in our just baby cherry tomatoes. So they're seasoned with salt and pepper. And you can hear the sizzle. And we're just gonna add a little sprig of thyme just for the flavor. And we're gonna turn that down a little bit to again medium. We don't want it to color too much. We just want them lightly cooked. When the cream and butter have melted together and it's reduced by about half, we can add in our eggs. So these are just beaten whole eggs. We don't add milk because we, add, we have cream in the pot now. We don't want it to be too creamy. So we're gonna bring that to a high heat again. And with a spatula, we're gonna start working it. So doing a scrambled egg is very much like doing, cooking a risotto at home. Once you start it, you can't walk away from it. You can see the egg, I just want to show you. You can see the egg starting to break up there. So everybody can see that egg starting to break. So at that point, we take it off the heat and we mix it because the heat's all at the bottom of the pot. So we keep mixing, we never ever stop mixing. So then we take it off the heat. And everybody can see the steam. So you can see how hot this pot is still. And our tomatoes are just roasting away, presentation side down, salt, pepper, and a little bit of thyme for flavor. Into this now, halfway through cooking, we add our famous smoked salmon. So we add in our smoked salmon. Now the reason we don't add the smoked salmon in at the start is because it would disintegrate, it would be tough. The smoked salmon will give a nice background flavor here because there's plenty of it in it. You can see we haven't put that on the heat and you can see how well it's coming together. How many eggs per person would you use? Eggs, probably about two to three. It depends on the people and what they want. Normally I, we would ask, you know, the same as making an omelet. Be like a two egg omelet or a three egg omelet, it's the same. So back on the heat for about 20 more seconds. So we're gonna add a tiny little bit of sea salt. And we're not gonna put it back on the heat now. There's enough heat at the bottom of that pot. And that's, that's us. That's the, that's the smoked salmon and scrambled egg, now completed. This is one we did earlier. So that's a smoked salmon and scrambled egg we did earlier, as we would serve in the restaurant in the mornings. That's a two egg one. So it's just your roasted tomatoes and a little bit of chive oil and chives on top. And that's our smoked salmon and scrambled eggs, guys, okay? Now, guys. Enjoy.